What's up guys, it's your next nightmare from the No Thumbs Crew and we are bringing you a video on damage per bullet for all the guns you can start with except the guns you earn from multiplayer such as the Street Sweeper, Sledgehammer and Katana. All the testing have been made without Ring of Fire, Elemental Pop and Deadshot and no ammo mods. On screen you see a chart where we have listed the guns from left to right from lowest to highest damage per bullet. All the red numbers are from when you start the game for a body shot and a headshot. The yellow numbers are when your gun are triple packed and maxed out in tier. So for assault rifle, the AK-47 is the only one that even getting close to do the same damage as some of the submachine guns and in my opinion all the assault rifle needs a damage buff. For submachine guns, we have the KSP, it will be doing a great deal of damage per bullet compared to the assault rifle. But have in mind it is a burst, so if you don't want to be tapping the trigger constantly, the Milano will be the best choice for you in this selection. For the tactical rifles, we have the DMR, it will be doing the most damage per bullet, but the M16 when packer punched, it will become a 6 bullet burst, so if you can land your shots, it will be doing the most damage. The M60 LMG is a heavy hitter, and it can hold up to 233 bullets in the clip, which makes this LMG a good choice for the penthouse strat. It's not a surprise that the Tantal Sniper doing a huge amount of damage. For pistol, we did the testing with a single pistol and not dual wheel. And here we have the Magnum. This hand cannon hits for 20,300 for a headshot. So with that shot, you will one hit kill for the entire game if you make headshots. All power to the Hauer. This shotgun is an absolute beast. It would one hit kill from the start of your game to the end of your game. Like this shotgun, you don't even need ring of fire or dead shot. Even after super sprinter zombies come, you will still one hit kill them. And megatrons with dead shot and ring of fire, you can insta kill them too. Launchers and special weapons is all about doing damage to groups. For the knife, you can one hit kill for the entire game if you make sure to pack a punch it and upgrade tier level on it. So what attachments do I need to get this damage you think? Well, all you need to do is to go into your crater class to the gunsmith and you want to go on the, the barrels. The barrels is all that matters. You will go and select the barrel to the task force. For most of the guns it will be the task force but like the LMG on screen you can also choose the division. There is one gun in this game where it's a complete other one, the AUG. You don't want to choose the task force for the AUG, you want to choose the strike team. That's all we have for you guys this time. Thank you for watching and hope you enjoyed. See you all in the next one. Peace out.